and I'm going to attempt to take a selfie. Got it. Oh, oh, I'm going to drop the phone. Somehow I did not drop the phone. I'm sure this audio sounds crispy. But something that I have gotten to work on in that time frame. One, your boy joined TikTok. <laughs> I can't even say it with a straight face. Let me try that again. One, your boy joined TikTok. I actually just posted one of me doing a horrible Dr. Doofenshmirtz voice. Um, a really bad Dr. Doofenshmirtz, Doofenshmirtz voice. I, I had to do it. Uh, Cause you know there's this feature on there called duets, man, and it's just so fun to duet. It, it really is. Uh, my favorite thing to do on there, excuse the loud noise, is I like to spit over beats. Cause your boy B hyphen is no longer ashamed, and I don't I don't mean like real ashamed, but your boy B hyphen is back in the motherfucking saddle, and I'm gonna attempt to take a selfie. God, oh oh, I'm gonna drop the phone. Somehow I did not drop the phone. I'm sure this audio sounds crispy. I'm just trying. I'm just trying to t take a picture of the action as it unfolds. Here, I'm gonna do this thing right. Uh, can I set a timer on the selfie? Y'all are probably like, "What the hell is wrong with him?" I don't care what y'all think. <laughs> there we go. Oh yeah, you were watching. Yeah. I got ten seconds, so I'm taking selfies anyway. Um, but yeah, I'm on TikTok, and I, your boy B hyphen's been rapping again. It's been really exciting to do. Um, I got several duets. I got some shorts uploaded. If you know what YouTube Shorts is, and that's a thing. Got some stuff on the Instagram. So yeah, I, I've been doing a little bit of everything. Um, on TikTok and. I will say one thing about TikTok that I did not expect. I just always thought it was about dancing. I thought I'd get it on there and, you know, I'm like, I don't, I'm not a dancer. You can ask my wife. I am not a dancer. Drunk hyphen, drunk hyphen. Oh, snap, son. Oh, snap. We gonna, we gonna, we gonna get it. We gonna get it. Um, but uh, sober hyphen is uh, very shy when it comes to busting a move. So when I discovered TikTok was one, hilarious, two, probably one of the least toxic social medias out there because it's just people going on there and doing these 30, 50, doing these short videos and either you, you have these people build communities out of, you know, people going on there and be like, hey, you know, you may be having a crappy day, but you know what? Chin up. And they got like thousands of followers just by doing that. You got people making food. You got my man Angry Reactions on there. Who gets on there and he's he literally looks super mean. He looks like this. I can't even do his face justice, and he looks real mad. And then, you know, like some, uh, he'll be duetting somebody. So this girl be like, nobody likes me. Nobody remember my birthday. He's like, I like you. I love you. You're gorgeous. Hilarious. Hilarious. All kinds of cool shits on TikTok. And then the fact that I've discovered that there's all these producers on there, and the duet feature literally lets me rap over their beats. And I can drop a verse or a couple bars or sing a little something over these joints and do them in like less than 10 minutes and have content that I'm actually kind of proud of. It's super cool. I'm kind of into TikTok. I'm not, I'm not afraid to lie. So I did discover TikTok, but that was more January. The big goal that I have now achieved was the YouTube channel. So for once again, for longtime listeners, uh, my YouTube channel was always just under my name. It was under Kellen Conway. And I decided that with me getting into streaming and with all this equipment I have bought for streaming, like this webcam I'm looking at right now, I was thinking, okay, well, we really, I really should go ahead and, and jazz up. Jazz up the YouTube. But I didn't want to, I didn't want to just do a Kellen Conway YouTube because there's so many different facets to me. And then, I realized that my URL for my main website, Hyphen Universe, was right there in front of me. So I made a Hyphen Universe channel. Now, one thing YouTube don't let you do is transfer content between channels very easily. Unless, like, I forget the reasons. Like, I think you gotta be... 
you you gotta ask and I mean maybe I could have asked but honestly I'm kind of glad I redid it but it's pain and ask get your content moved from one channel to another so what I ended up doing I went through <laughs> up to that moment all 173 episodes of hyphenation made thumbnails new thumbnails combined those thumbnails with the audio through 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 however many would let me at a time some days it was 10 some days it was 15 other days I felt like I could barely do like a couple but I got them all uploaded I went through and did all the titles all the descriptions all the hashtags all the tags all the categories made playlists and I had originally wanted to launch this YouTube channel on November 7th I don't know what the hell I was thinking because that's not what happened at all. <laughs> that's not what happened. So I'd say within the last month, 45 days, I got everything where I wanted it to be on the channel. So Hyphen Universe is officially launched on YouTube. You can just search it and if, subscribe, please. You can like it. You can hit the bell so you never miss an episode. Ding, ding. <laughs> um, but, but yeah, I have, a, I have a real YouTube channel again. So it has every hyphenation episode. It has uh, those uh, YouTube duets I was talking about with me rapping and stuff like that. That's on there. There's some... I actually realized that I had lost the video... And I was kind of upset about it. It was episode 167, but then I found it again recently. So I just dropped from episode 167. I dropped the section where I was talking about Tupac. Um, that's on there. But I'm going to be doing all kinds of stuff on there. I'm going to be doing more of my uh, TikTok stuff. Like at least musical music wise will go up on there. When as I progress in making new music, I'll be uploading stuff there. Um, I actually want to be utilizing this technology right here to be making videos for YouTube where I was just like, you know what? I got this verse because I've been thinking about it and I was like determined. I have these projects in my mind. I was determined I was going to make at least two mixtapes and these mixtapes are going to be a bunch of industry beats. So I had all these beats like that you've heard over the years that I just love. I was like, I'm going to rap over this. I'm going to rap over this. And then I realized why I can't stream those anywhere except for SoundCloud really and Bandcamp. So... Shout out to my man Spike E. He's been doing these Thursday freestyles over old beats. And I was like, you know what? I'm going to take his idea. And literally, if I really feel moved by a beat, I'm going to drop these drop these whole verses on video form. And then if I want to upload it to YouTube, or, um, if I want to upload it somewhere, I can. But then I got the video right there. So there's video content there. And I'm just spitting, man. It's like... <coughs> got my droplets on you uh so that, that's that's my plan there I'm, I'm actually really excited about the youtube channel and and because your boy got so good at making youtube content for one channel there's a rasslecast power hour youtube channel too and i got video on the dame interview and the savannah summers interview and the one we did with cat chinetti our good friend cat from a podcast that you should be listening to called we should do this again sometime with cat and mark Got the whole video of that up. Yeah. So I'm very excited about the YouTube channel. Man. I'm only 35 minutes in. I'm tired. <laughs> Bro, I'm kind of tired. Next topic. If I'm even on a topic. Was that a topic? I was like, where have I been? And... Here's my YouTube channel. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And leave a comment. Ding! <laughs> oh, man.